Is that too close? Is that the lens there? People of Scotland, does my honorous, I think there's a wee smudge. Does my honorous, have you got the sound on? Does my honorous duty, people of Scotland, does my, oh, people of Scotland, welcome. In the interests of Scottish public safety, Scottish public morale, and Scottish public interest in me, the authorities, the powers that be, have deemed it necessary, nay, vital, that I address the nation. The eagle-eyed amongst you will have noticed that I am not in my office. Like the rest of the nation, I am working from home. I'm currently being filmed by my assistant, Jean. She was, in fact, delivering a five iron to my house when the lockdown instructions were issued, and she has remained loyally by my side ever since, at a safe distance of two metres. Unfortunately, I do not have my full uniform. The jacket and helmet is still at headquarters. I do have uh, this helmet, which was a gift from the Gibraltar uh, police force when I went over there for their Christmas party. Um, I've never really had occasion to wear it. I could, Jean, and I mean, it certainly says, what do you think? It says helmet, but does it say authority? Yes, is it coming across a little bit small? Does it still look like it's on my nap or is it just kind of, what? Okay, lose the helmet. I am here to assure you that all will be well. We are still policing. We are just policing remotely. I continue to run the entire Scottish police force right here and all will be well. I will get the job done. You can expect to see a change in some policing methods. Stop and search will change. We will still be stopping and searching, but we will be asking suspects to search themselves. Handcuffing is also changing. We found that people have been using so much hand sanitizer that the handcuffs are just sliding straight off. Every bam in the land is like Harry Houdini. So from now on, if you're a bam, we'll be asking you to raise your hands above your head like so, and the officers will lasso you and drag you to justice. I have also fast-tracked truncheon extensions. They make the truncheon a minimum of two meters, a maximum of four meters long, and the extensions work very much like snooker cues when you screw in the extension when you're using the spider for the long shots. Quite simple, click, screw, stop, you're nicked. Now, the science tells us that two meters is the safe distance that we must remain apart from each other. I have some official police guidance on how best to visualize uh, two meters. I hope this is helpful. Two meters is 86 fingers of Kit Kat. It's one and a half sturgeons. Uh, that's First Minister sturgeon. Uh, it's actually uh, 16 sturgeons, uh, the fish. Two yards and a bit of ale. Two metres is not a guinea on the putting green. So basically, stay apart from each other the distance of putt that you wouldn't give in a four ball. That's two metres explained in the sort of language that any proud Scots person should understand. Of course, even in these difficult and desperate times, there are reasons to be cheerful. Yes, the European Championship qualifiers have been postponed, but that means that Scotland have yet to be eliminated. Likewise, England have yet to be crowned Six Nations champions. Even Sandy Lyle, technically, is still in the running for this year's US Masters. And of course, in further good news, crime figures are down. Housebreaking is down. Pub brawls are down. Disturbances and organised marches all down. So finally, stay safe, Scotland. We're all on it together. No, that's not quite right, Gene, is it? Well, we're all, no, hang on, what did Sturgeon say? We're all in the all together. No, we're, we've all got this together, we go together. No, we're, we're all, we're all in this together. Stay safe, Scotland. Good night. Sure you pressed a card, Gene?